What's up guys, Rexon34 back with another video and today we have our last part of our beginning and end Ghost Rare series where we open 1st edition Tactical Evolution, the first set with Ghost Rares and 1st edition Dimension of Chaos, the last set with Ghost Rares and then of course we have Epic Zexal Packs and Stardust Overdrive. So for the giveaway in this video, we give away these three cards. Let me know in the comments if you want to see more beginning and end kind of series, like not necessarily the exact same, but you know, like random stuff like that were open, you know, the first and the last, or maybe like, you know, two similar sets, or something like that. Let me know if you guys give me some ideas, you know, throw them at me and I'll be open to them. So let's go ahead and open these. I'm super pumped to open these because the first two openings were awesome. We did really, really good, way better than I expected, to be honest. So I'm hyped up. I'm thinking that the third part can top them all. So let me know in the comments if you think we can top them. Because we did really good, but we didn't do insane. Like, you you can do a little better. Not much better. You can do a little better. Here we go. DD Necro Slime. Nice common. Always a good start with the DD Necro Slime. Generation Force. Okay, here we go. So we have pulled something epic out of every pack except Dimension of Chaos, which is unusual because we always pull something epic out of there. So really, it's up to uh, Dimension of Chaos to uh, help us out here. Attention. Okay. Go, go, go. And Phantom Magician. All right, so we have we actually have five starters overdrives in this video because I had 13, and so I did four in the other two, but now we have a fifth for this one. So here we go. Uh oh, swap frog. We got a nice common. This one's a uh, pulling away from a spider egg. Secret rare, dark, smorg, smorg. However you say this guy, the bird guy. Wow. I don't know what kind of value this card has, but it's definitely pretty. Pretty awesome. Secret Rare from Stardust Overdrive. Our first Secret Rare of the series, I think, actually. I don't know to think about it, so that's amazing. That's a good start. That's a good start, Stardust Overdrive. Let's see if we can pull a good common out of here. Ground Spider, we really want that a pointer of the Red Lotus. It's a very expensive card. What Let's go back this? to Generation Force before we get into Tactical Evolution. Let's see if we can hit something good. Here we go. Crash Bug Y. Asleep at the switch. Not good. Master or something. United Front. Crash Bug X, Crash Bug Road, Skull Kraken, and Burgeoning Whirlwind. All right. Let's get into our first one, our first Tactical Evolution first edition pack. We have done pretty awesome from Tactical Evolution so far. So if we can keep that up, that would be incredible. Here we go. We got a Nex, Chrysalis Larva, Venom Burn. We have a Venom Serpent, and an Aquarian Alessa. We got another super rare. So we have pulled a few supers. I think it might be a third or fourth one total. So pretty cool first edition tactical evolution. Super rare. That's pretty awesome. Shadow Delver and Strike Slash. Okay. On to Generation Force. We've started off pretty well. A secret rare and a super rare first edition. Oh, there we go. There goes the pack. Okay. Generation Force. Can we pull that number 17? I really want to pull that card. If we don't pull that, we're going to have to probably search for that. Gishki Diviner. And a Super Crash Bug, which you guys told me. This is a computer bug, not an insect bug. I had no idea, to be honest. It makes more sense, but apparently they talk about it in the show. And I haven't seen the show yet, but one day I will see it. Cra Super Crash Bug. Would you guys recommend the Zexel show if you guys actually watched it? All right, let's go with Stardust Overdrive again. I've never watched it. I've watched half of 5Ds. I've watched the first two series, and that's it. And I think I'll finish 5Ds soon, I think. Oh, here we go. Spiritual Forest. Attack Pheromones. Swap Frog. Common. Nice. Seal of Wickedness. I didn't realize it was coming up right there. These come up early. They come up on the fourth card for Stardust Overdrive. Seal of Wickedness. I don't know if I've ever seen that card, so that's pretty cool. Another foil, Zero Gardener, Regulus, Toon Magician, Infernity Force, and Quick Draw Synchron. Yeah, make sure to let me know if I miss any, if I don't mention any commons. I will try to look them up later, but I know Point of the Red Lotus is amazing. And there are a couple other ones I can't remember off the top of my head. Okay, here we go. Generation Force, Tyrant's Tummy Ache, Goblin Berg, Attention. Ooh, a Pain Painter, Secret Rare. That is an ugly card. Is that a, a zombie that paints? I guess that's hence the pain. But that's a little weird. Two secret rares. So this is going well. This is going really well so far. Okay. So what are we down to? 
Let's go with another Generation Force, even it out at three packs per every pack, you know, three packs per pack. Yeah, very confusing. Okay. Here we go. Master of the Flaming Dragon Swords, Aqua Jet, Drill Barnacle, Curse of the Circle, Smashing Horn, back to back, Secret Rares. Oh my goodness. Is that out of the same set? Oh my goodness. Back to back secrets out of the same set. I know this one isn't too good because we did pull it before, but still, a secret is a secret. That's pretty awesome. Back to back secret rares from the same packs. Whew. This, this opening has been nice. All right, here we go. Oh man. We dropped it. Okay, here we go. Let's go. You gotta hit something big here, Dimension of Chaos. Hasn't really hit us anything. I mean, honestly, we've pulled so much good stuff out of all the packs, you can't really complain. Wave King Caesar, Yada, Galilei. Let's go with a Stardust Overdrive and see if we can pull the Appointer of the Red Lotus. We're going for a common this time. I'm calling that we get it in this fit in this uh, pack. Here we go. Earthbound Wave, Spider Web, Relinquish Spider, Negaton Core Panel, Herculean Power, Spider Spider. Oh, I thought that was it. Wolf and Sheep's Clothing and Medusa. I think it's short printed, so it's not the easiest thing to pull. But, obviously, if you do pull it, it's very expensive, so pretty nice. All right, back to Generation 4. So far, we're on a two-secret streak with this set. So, can it keep it up? I highly doubt it, but I would take it. Crash Bug Z. Damage Vaccine Max. Sky Star Ra <laughs> This card was annoying in Duel Links. Drill Balance. Vylon Filament. Wind Up Soldier. And Treaty of the Uniform Nomenclature. Make sure to hit the like button, guys, if you guys are enjoying the video. And, of course, subscribe, because we got some epic content coming up. Here we go. Tactical Evolution. Eventually, hopefully, the 10K special, which is overdue. I know. Unfortunately, I can't control the mail. I can buy, All I can do is buy it. Flint Missile. Flint Lock. These are way off-center. Rise of Snake Deity. Dawn Break Gardener. Yes! Another ultimate rare! Only 12 packs, two ultimate rares, fifth hope, and this is one of the most epic ones. Wow, look at that card, it's super clean. Is it okay up there? Yeah, I think it is. Fifth hope, that has all the original elemental heroes on it. Avian, Berserk, Spark Man, Bubble Man, and Clay Man. What's the centering look like? It looks pretty good. I think this could get a 10. It has the weirdly cut corners, but sometimes they, for some reason, take off for, which is really weird. <sighs> I'm loving these tactics. I've never pulled well from Tactical Evolution until this, until these last three openings that I've done. It's the only time. Before that, I was awful. Like, I would never pull anything. I would just pull supers. That was it. I opened, I once on the channel, I opened 48 Tactical Evolution packs and pulled one ultimate. Zero secrets. Zero ghosts. Yeah, it was, and I, no, in, in Zero Ultras, too. It was all supers and one ultimate. It was the worst thing ever. So go back and check that out if you guys want. I was trying to get that misprint rainbow dragon, and I just got nothing. That's what I got. So it was great. The the uh, Tactical Evolution version, which may or may not even come in the packs I opened, but DD Necro Slime. Okay. So, yeah, that was a heck of a pull. That was a really good pull. I mean, the card isn't super valuable, but it has all of the elemental heroes on it. And yeah, it's amazingly awesome looking. And I don't think the pop's very high for 10. So if we got a 10, it would be pretty cool. Okay, here we go. Phantom Magician, Peking Goblin, Overwind, Aqua Jet, Big Jaws, Wind Up Dog, Utopian Aura, Achacha Archer, wow. and Puppeteer. Okay. All right, Stardust Overdrive. We haven't pulled any, um, we've pulled a secret out of here. We pulled an Ultra. We haven't pulled an Ultimate though. So are we due? I'd take it. Spider Web, Level Eater, Gemini Spark, Raging Mad Plants, Gemini Booster, Insect Neglect, Bending Destiny, and Molten Escape. Okay, we're back in the Tactical Evolution. We've, we've already pulled Amazing out of here, so I guess maybe hope for a secret, but that's just, I mean, that's just asking for a lot because we've pulled two ultimates already. Flint Missile, Flint Lock, Rise of the Snake Deity, Phantom Dragon Ray Bronto, Ringe, Gatekeeper of Dark World, Cocoon Party, Ritual Raven, Neospatian Marine Dolphin. Okay, one of each pack left. We're killing it this opening. So, yeah, anything else is just gravy on top at this point. Let's see what we can do. T 
TD Scroll Slime, Contract Change, Cobra, Salvin Keeper, Help Princess, Evening Twilight Night. This is super rare. I think it's over a dollar. We also got a Necro Slime. We got a Necro Slime as well. She can go next to that other one. And then, um, is that the Yada again? Man, these Yadas are everywhere. Okay, three packs left. Generation Force. Alas, Generation Force is number 17, Leviathan Dragon Ultimate Rare. Not even the Ghost Rare. I'm just asking for the Ultimate Rare. That's all I'm asking for. Is that is that too much? No, I don't think it is. Spearfish Soldier, Fishing Kicks, United Front, Pokey Draco, Poseidon Wave, Future Glow, and Skull Kraken. <sighs> Two packs left. <sighs> Let's do this. Start us overdrive. Let's pull an ultimate or a secret rare. I'm thinking ultimate rare. Dark Spider. Gemini Spark. Gemini Counter. Spiritual Forest. Fortune Lady Earth. Asha Leon. It's like Neglock. Time <laughs> Neglock. And Inferno Force. So we didn't get any. We didn't get any of the uh, Point of the Red Lotus, which stinks. But it is tough to pull. So last pack is First Edition Tactical Evolution. Let's do this. Hit the like button if you guys have enjoyed this series. Make sure to let me know any other series you would want to see. You know, you guys can come up with ideas, and I will, of course, listen to them. Potentially do them. Rise of Snake Deity. Dawnbreak Gardener. Convert Contact. Whew, here we go. Ghost Rare. Let's do this. And an Ocean's Keeper. Okay, so we didn't get anything in the last pack, but that's okay. Because we did awesome in this video. We did awesome in all of the videos, so let's show what we got. We got an Evening Twilight Night, two DD Necro Slime, an Ultimate Rare, Fifth Hope, absolutely amazing pull. That is super awesome. Back to back Secret Rares, that was pretty cool. Seal of Wickedness, a Swap Frog, the Computer Bug, not the Insect, Mass Change, Aquarian Alessa, a Secret Rare, Dark Samorg, that was awesome. Another Swap Frog and another Necro Slime. So we did pretty awesome. If you enjoyed the video, make sure to like it and subscribe because we got more epic content coming. And thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys later. Peace. Secret.